to week three's activity. Now, if you've been following this series, you know that week three was all about finding the peace. Now, we have done the search. We have accepted the facts. We faced the facts. And now we have decided to find the peace with it all. So the activity today is going to really focus on quietness and stillness. Because when you think about peace, I always envision it as the stillness of a body of water. When you look at a lake or um, a river that is still, it's uninterrupted, unbothered, but it's just still. You can feel the peace that comes from that presence. And so that is what we are going to focus on for this activity and that and, and really getting quiet and getting still. Now, as you begin this activity, I want you to set an intention for yourself. And that intention is that you are inviting in peace. You may even want to say out loud, peace, I invite you into my space. Once you have set your intention, I want you to say out loud and call your name. So for example, for me, I would say, Mo, I forgive you for any and all hurt, trauma, pain that you may have experienced, whether I caused it or someone else caused it. I want you to know that I hold no grudge for what has happened and I am ready to invite in peace. Mm. I want you to say that to yourself as if you are talking to your best friend. And I want you to say it with conviction. And then once you've said that to yourself, I just want you to sit with those words for just a few minutes and let that resonate. Let that get down into your spirit that you have actually offered words and energy of forgiveness. That you have actually invited in peace. Don't rush this. Sit with that. You might begin to feel emotional. I know for me, and sometimes in some cases, I have experienced the notion of crying. Um, I have experienced a notion of feeling like something is literally falling off of me. So whatever your body is feeling at that time just flow with it go with divine flow next once you have done that i want you to practice a mindful meditation exercise now for some people i've heard them say that meditation is very difficult because um, it's hard to concentrate and I understand that 100% because you have to practice controlling your mind, practice allowing the chatter to just fall off and fall away. And so in the beginning of this mindful meditation practice, you may become frustrated because all of the thoughts that keep coming to you, I'm going to encourage you, sis. Don't allow yourself to feel frustrated. If thoughts come, just let them flow right on by. Don't attach yourself to any of them, okay? So with this mindful meditation practice, I just want you to sit for about five minutes. If you wanna set your timer, you can. 
And all we are going to do is breathe. You are going to breathe in very deep. And I want you to really focus on your breath. And when you exhale, I want you to exhale with a verbal thank you. Each time. I don't know how many breaths you're going to get in in five minutes, but however many it is, if it's three, if it's five, if it's eight, every time you breathe in, I want you to focus on the breath that you are pulling in, the oxygen that you are pulling in to your existence. And then I want you to exhale and with a verbal thank you each time. The thank you is because you're expressing gratitude. You're expressing genuine gratitude to yourself for doing this work. And then finally, when you've done all of those exercises, I just want you to journal. Pick up your journal and write. Any thoughts that come to you, write it down. All the things that you are ready to release and forgive, all of those things, I want you to write them down because we are getting ready for week number four, which is forgive and release. So have fun with this activity. Be kind to yourself with this activity. Be gentle with yourself. Have compassion for yourself and take your time. Thanks for tuning in. And I'll see you in week four. I love you. And as always, sis, thanks so much for tuning in. And if you like this video, do me a favor and hit the like and subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss out on any of my latest content as it's being released, go ahead and hit the notification bell icon as well. Thanks for joining and I'll see you next time. with me.